guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I look frazzled and it's barely 1 o'clock in the afternoon. But I thought I'd show you guys our grocery haul <clears throat> for the next two weeks, which also includes Christmas. So I'll, let's jump into that. Okay, so here is the overhaul. Excuse the mess underneath my table. I tell my children to pick up the living room and they never clean up under the table for some reason. I think it's an out of sight, out of mind situation. So, we are going to go ahead and start on this side. So, cereal for my kids, mainly my daughter. This is the only cereal she'll eat, and this is pretty much the only thing she'll eat, period. I also have quick oats and old fashioned oats for, um, let's see. Give me a second, I'll get my menu. Okay, so here's my menu, and when it's a holiday, I typically do about two weeks. Well, I do two weeks anyway. So here's breakfast ideas. Sorry, it got a little wet, so it's smeared on me. But here are breakfast ideas and lunch ideas, and then here are the dinners, and then of course you see for here we've got Christmas dinner, and then we've got my Christmas dinner mapped out. So... The oatmeal is for the cherry oatmeal pie that we're going to have for that breakfast and the apple crisp. So we're going to be using those for that. I've got chips for today's lunch to go with today's lunch. We've got four bags of potatoes because we have a lot of potato on this menu. Um, so this is all thanks, or not Thanksgiving, but this is all Christmas meal. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to switch over here. So back there we've got some tortillas for quesadillas because my middle son likes to eat that for lunch. We've got bread for sandwiches. We've got more, but we only needed one loaf, so I only got one loaf today. We've got our apples for snacks and apple crisp. We've got our cuties because my daughter loves to eat these and so do my boys. We've got grapes for snacks, baking soda for baking in everyday use. We've got flour. We've got, what is this? I think that's sugar. Sugar. I've got canned chicken for lunches. I've got tubs of, so this is part of our Thanksgiving stuff, or not Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving's over. Our Christmas stuff. I guess I'm stuck in November. These are these three tubs of whipping topping or whipped topping are for our dessert slash breakfasts because of we're doing a different break or dessert for dessert um, Christmas dessert instead of like a pumpkin pie. I found a pumpkin cheesecake. They call it a pumpkin lasagna, but it calls for two of these. And then one of these is for our apple pie, our apple crisp, and our cherry apple pie breakfasts. We've got hazelnut, amaretto, and sweet cream, or cold stone sweet cream uh, creamers for coffee. I have a giant, I think it's 10 pounds. Yeah, I have a giant 10 pound bag for shake and bake because my husband loves shake and bake. I have bacon for breakfast meals. I have a potato soup that I'm going to make. Plus, um, if I don't have leftover ham from our thanks or our Christmas meal, I'm going to make a bean soup with hopefully the leftovers of the ham. But if there's not enough ham, we've got some bacon for the bean soup. Pepperoni because one pack is for pizzas, one pack is for snacking. Ground beef for spaghetti and cheeseburger soup. We've got Italian sausage, this goes in my um, spaghetti sauce. String cheese for snacking. Uh, we've got plenty of saltines, so we've got the buttery rounds or the, you know, generic Ritz, I guess because my kids and my husband love those. We've got lunch meat, so black forest ham, uh, salami, and then we've got roast beef, butter, pepper jack cheese for our cheeseburger soup, some Classico sauce. I put these and these two cans of diced tomatoes in my crock pot spaghetti sauce. 
as well as the two meats. Um, cream of mushroom and cream of chicken soups for my potato soup. I've got two cans of artichokes, one of them went somewhere, but two cans of artichokes for pizza toppings. Uh, we do zucchini and peppers on a veggie pizza with some onions. Four packs of hash browns because there's ten of them in a pack. So if I make this for breakfast, for either breakfast breakfast or dinner breakfast, uh, our family will eat through two packs. So we needed four. Um, pizza sauce for homemade pizza. My husband's favorite, Death Wish Coffee. He wanted to try these protein muffin mixes. We've tried the um, Kodiak cake, so he wanted to try these half and half for coffee. We needed more basil. There's my other can of artichokes. I use these, I've mentioned before, for beef stocks and gro gravies. I've got a chicken one back there as well. Let's see. So I use these. Um, we've got tuna for my oldest son who likes to eat tuna for lunch. We've got angel hair pasta for our spaghetti night. And then here we're getting into our Christmas meal. So we've got cauliflower, one for my fa favorite cauliflower salad. I made this in my Thanksgiving cook with me and I even had it in my grocery haul for Thanksgiving. So one cauliflower head is for the cauliflower salad, one is for snacking to go with our veggie tray here that I got on sale. So this is for snacking on Christmas Day along with some brie and crackers, some apples and caramel. This is for our, like I said, it's called a pumpkin lasagna, but I, I don't know, it looks more like a pumpkin cheesecake to me. So that's what that's for, some cream cheese for both the cheesecake, pumpkin cheesecake dessert, plus some cheesecake, uh, cream cheese goes into my pumpkin, or my potato soup. Then we're going to do regular salad for those who don't like cauliflower salad, which is pretty much everyone in my house. Then we're going to do ham for our main meat, as well as mashed potatoes, we're going to do an apple pie, I just bought this because it only makes two crusts. So then apple pie mix and then the cherry, one can of cherries for our cherry oatmeal pie and then cherry and blueberry cobbler. But we're going to do a cobbler slash crisp mix because we're just going to throw these two on top. The pumpkin for the pumpkin lasagna thing. This is the green olives for my cauliflower salad and then we're going to do oh and the ginger snaps for the crust to the pumpkin cheesecake then we're going to do spinach corn and carrots as our sides and then i have panko crumbs for our what was that shake and bake and then i've got celery green onions, pinto beans for other recipes and meals and so yeah there we go that's our grocery haul for Christmas dinner and the next couple of weeks this week and next week I think to at least the second or the third if you're new here don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're not new here I thank you for your support and appreciate you being here um, I say I'm a lot. I'm trying to stop doing that. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my grocery haul. I'll see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to hit the thumbs up if you want to see more like this. Don't forget to hit the bell if you want to be notified when I upload. And I'll see you guys. Bye.